guys, you want to go to www.chsorderform.com. Okay, once in here, you want to log yourself in. Even if this is your first time, you want to come to log yourself in. If you've been here before, you can put your returning customer, your email address and password that you made, but if you haven't done it before, you can go ahead and make a new one. So we'll put Ms. Alice Keeler. Now for your address, you want to put in your room number. So I am room D07. And then my city is Clovis. You can put whatever you want in there. 93611. It requires that you put a city in zip code. But, you know, obviously it doesn't matter. But for your address, make sure you put your room number so that they know where to deliver it. And for your telephone, put your actual extension so that they can call you if they need to. And then you want to put in your email address, so alicekeeler at cusd.com, and go ahead and make a password. And there you go. You've registered for supplies. So once you've done that, you can go ahead. You can see up here there is links. Or even on the left hand side to the different supplies. You can also even search. I'll put in stapler. And so I have an option for a stapler. Pencil. These are some different pencils. So you can search for things. So once you're in the category, you can say how many of each thing that you want. And it's being a little ridiculous here. I want some binders. So once I add those, I'm going to add the selected products to the cart. And you'll notice up here at the top, it says I've added them. Maybe I'm going to order some pins. So I'm going to get me some black dry erase pins. And I'm going to order 2,000 of those. And I'm going to order me some highlighters. So whatever you want. Now you'll notice down here there's actually 20 products and only 10 of them are showing. So you want to click next if there's other products that you want to take a look at. So I'm going to add those to the cart. So once I have the items that I want to use, I have a couple of options. I can just click over here where it says shopping cart. Okay, I also have the cart right here. And it says shopping cart and checkout up at the top. So I'm going to go ahead and click shopping cart. So there's lots of places that you can get to the shopping cart. You'll notice it says that the products are out of stock. They're always going to say they're out of stock. Um, so that doesn't matter. Ignore that. So once you have all the items that you want to order, you can just go ahead and click go to checkout. Now this is a three-step process. Notice there's step one of three, and it seems kind of ridiculous. This is a, an order form, but it's actually pretty fast and easy. You just want to go ahead and walk in. If you have special instructions, you know, in this case, I'm going to type in, this is a fake order. Do not fill. Okay, and then I want to click continue checkout. Now you notice that I'm on step two of three. Okay, I don't need to I don't need to pay anything. I don't need to do it. I'm just gonna scroll all the way down and I'm gonna continue checkout. Okay, now this is step three of three. So make sure you go through all three steps. So once again, just go all the way down and you have to confirm the order. Now once you confirm the order, you're gonna get an email telling you what you had ordered so you know that you did it right. And that's about it. That's all you need to do. And the supplies should be coming your way.